and welcome to One Community Project. I'm Reginald Hassan. And today, I bring you another story. Yes, I bring you a story of lighting up the world. I bring you an African light up story. Yes, a true African story and how a group of people have come together to light up the world starting from their community. This is another story of the Uguta people in Imo state of Nigeria. This is the story of Light Up Uguta. Good afternoon, my brother, Barista Emeka Okoro Afo. How are you today, sir? I'm fine. Mr. Nice to connect with you. And thanks again for letting us disrupt your work today. Uh, we're calling you at work. and But it's something very important about uh, the initiative of the Light of uh, Uguta and what they are doing to brighten up Uguta. Thank you very much, Hassan. Uh, my name is uh, Mecca Okorafo. I'm the son of Justice, late Justice SN Okorafo from Abatu Beach. Um, when my auntie died about three years ago, I was in Uguta and everywhere was in pitch darkness. So I decided to light up my streets and adjoining streets as an example to our people so that we can adopt the initiative of lighting up Ubuta. So three years down the line, a few other individuals had joined up, but I had an idea which I published uh, in the Loop uh, um, platform, uh, inviting uh, some group of people to join me so that we can light up Uguta. So the following people uh, were formed into a, a committee. We grouped ourselves and called ourselves Light Up Uguta Initiative. Lord Lord Do, Guy Halam, Mr. Henry Josai, Barister F. Kungapa, Mr. Stein Atoku, Mr. Val Anene, Ugua Gwenest Napa, Ugua Agifan Yobona. Uh, in the Abuchiyo side, Dr. Felix Okosa and Mr. Uche Aniche. So we formed ourselves into the Light Up Uguta initiative and we decided that uh, it better we make direct uh, pitch to some affected Uguta people. So each person will speak to somebody he feels comfortable with to, to pull the resources, pull our resources and um, to light up every street in Uguta. Okay. So, Kawonya of Naya, Aslanya, Niki Dab or Kwanya, only of Nogra and Niwi Baya, Koya can make it open Kayaya. No matter what you call the Yaya, you are trying to go to the next. He had never to me, Nafu, she was with the Nabo of Kwanya, Nakamo de Kamini Bay, Nakan Goshua, or Pangodi, the Okanya of Ku, Nani Akapa Azaba, Nakia Shua, no Kuno, no. It's okay. And if you are Karibu, a security to the right. The last street, the last road within Uguta. Both the street and the road in Uguta. At the night side, at the road, the whole night. The Tracy Road, at the Tracy Road. In general, the police station to Kuebu Road, have to share to the bridge. Then you can have Crystal Lake, have to share to the gate of Crystal Lake Hotel. I go back to that. The Batana Imobodo, 
Mishina Uke Rube, the street Rube, Rube Cruz, down to Ngebu side, down to uh, Umude, Uzo omit by the junction. Actually, I can mean at Chiroko Mine. A Pagani Mobunini, Obunini, Pagani Mobu, Chichi, Fona, Goshinu, Danam Rocha. So, not to shall go to Nino, it was a natural. So there are 11 of us in this committee with this light of Puguta initiative. And I don't know one other platform. I don't know you post through something like that. Look, I don't agree. What can we do differently? I'm going to be there. So I think I'm below with Uncle, but I'm at that point still in Buta with so much insecurities. So um, I'm going to reach out to a few Buta individuals who are very deliberate. We had a minimum contribution of three hundred and fifty thousand, and there was no maximum. So a few people gave us one point five million. You know, I have one million. We only have five hundred thousand, and three fifty that was our minimum. So we're able to raise over 23 million naira and four thousand dollars. Come down and million dollars. So um, so far we have installed over 600 solar powered lamps across the Buta, both Nimo Bodo, Mana Plot, up to from Ugebuwa Amaracha, even the uh, plantation. I even put our own Crystal Lake Hotel. I be the one who buy the In government, in fact, eighty percent of only two years ago now we no go do it. Go. Only because of Lagos, Port Harcourt, Abuja, only the only people who can imagine. Uh, in Zimbabwe, they very delighted with the fact that I am. I now I invited her to one of our meetings. Or express her when I happiness. The fact that I am. In fact, I now I have permission. I am no national. initiative. <laughs> And then you're not going to ask him, Bona. Oh, sorry, it's a money menu. You cannot forget to that money. I can even retain those daughters. So, you know, I'm not going to make a good thing. I mean, I'm going to make a good thing. 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 I'm going to make a ケケレニゴのワネケネンデニネソロバコトアカオノモレズトアコナケイニゴタナチュクアレコリコオコニワニベオモニワレジュノノオモニワナウグルキアカオノクエネムニウオオクチュクエネムニウオオクマレネムニ
Mapana, any project, no one in a window to be the idea which we to the table. And then the common friends say they invite other people to join in uh, the population say then it's better on in the Madi Bidogia. Um a few of us and it's on the back of you say which our sons and daughters have been doing in the past like, few years. And then my own who have gone as far as installing solar street lights and streets. I don't personally, but I'm so proud of what's going on in that area. I think that Metro Corral has been all the different streets. But many other people. La Anime Mebosu, and it belongs to all of us. What we make out of it is what we will be. Um, unfortunately, Ubusa has suffered tremendous neglect at the hands of successive governments in the state. It appears that we just been forgotten at the community. It will be only made to and as you know, we've had this electricity challenge for so many years, about 20 years, as, uh, as far as I can remember. Okay, I've been in Ubuta. Ubuta has been in total darkness. So this is historic, it's an epic event. And only do me, I should have been the So we paid them mad, the mad. And this is just the beginning. There is so much that needs to happen in the future. Development is so backward currently. And if they only have a good should really think about is how we harness the resources that in the new future to transform Ubuta into a developed 21st century town. And if you look just down the road, a few things like Okija, maybe we are doing so much in terms of development, the instrument of solarization of the community, the democracy, the water, the basic communities, the economic activity. And this is what we need to bring to Ubuta. And when there's economic activity, then it has a tripping effect on all areas. Uh, young people will have jobs. Currently, they don't have any jobs. There's unemployment at a very high level, which continues to push them into criminal activity, unfortunately. So when we have economic development and activity, then that would impact on the employment and status of our young people. It will also drive tourism to Ubuta because this is a town that is blessed, as we know, with a beautiful day. So that is potential for tourism when we can harness them. Ubuta has so much. There is so much, so much. So you can be a one of them as go beyond the name, you know, to develop in Buddha, to transform the town, to bring glory to the town, to prosper our people. There are so many people who need to go into work, into business, into economic activity that would enhance their economic empowerment. We need to begin to do this, especially for our young people. They don't want to address it, they don't want to address it. To, to, to develop the staff. And of course, we know the benefits of this electricity project. It's going to enhance the security uh, situation that we currently have. I mean, why are they in Ubuda? Because of the security challenge that we've had in the past uh, few years. So, this is going to Eliminate the whole town. So, this is going to be difficult for criminals to operate in Ubuta. And this will slow down 
criminal act. And then if you are coming back from, if you are coming down from, uh, um, uh, from the, you feel that the whole Buddha, the experience of uh, EDC, that's what sort of this individual effort to make sure that the town is justified and I commend them to that effect because it is a philanthropic move to them. And I will allow, I will please, I will make sure that people of Buddha make sure we appreciate them. So they will do more. If somebody does something and they appreciate what's going on. So I stand my feet to thank them very, very well. The individuals that have come together and thought it wise to enumerate the Buddha. They thank Buddha, thank Buddha, and they thank Buddha. Now we know that we feel that we are just here in London, we are just busy to them. They thank God that Buddha made it. They really cheap. Oh, yeah, I need someone. I say, they ship us right there. And they're going to say, sir, not to hold that one. See, because of the blue wish, the job is time, the beautiful time. And you can never see any town like you, like you, like you, like you, like you, like you. Unlike when uh, Senegal, Dakar was running, the most beautiful city in West Africa. But there is now the most beautiful city in West Africa. That is, if you come to see it. Please, you have to come have a view. Buddha is a holiday resort. Buddha is right from time. Of our mom, mom, mom. Golf course, golf, international golf course, Buddha Motel. Brought by letter of Professor Farah, uh, uh, and a lot of incentives brought by this one. Made Buddha to become a holiday resort, number one holiday resort. And so challenges. So I thank the whole people, the whole individuals that taking their time, their economic uh, part of it, to make sure that they are Doctor, our ancestors have already done this. If you look at that new layout that we call plot, it was um, initiated by people like uh, Loyal Biora, uh, Dr. Udom, HBO Udom, uh, the Zimiros. They were the people that got a master plan from the Potako GRA and they translated it into the Uguta Urban Development Plan. So our forefathers, in fact, I was going through my father's things and I saw where as a member of the Uta Youth Movement, they were contributing money for uh, the plotting of that layout. So Uta people have been known for that and it's a hand down from uh, our, our progenitors. So um, I do believe that we should continue in that self-help initiative, if you go to Rome, if you go to London, if you go to Atlanta, they were built by people, not uh, government in quotes. They were built by people. These are private initiatives that you know the um, the government has, at the time will key in. Uh, Las Vegas, Miami was built by uh, private money. If you go to California, Los Angeles. It was built most by the Jewish money. So um, we as Ubuta people, we are known for that. And I would want us to continue uh, in that light. And I also want to state here categorically that you do not have to vote, uh, have money or be prominent or anything for you to contribute your own quota. Because all of us, we are working together. The people who are using the lamps, they, they are going to secure the lamps. They are all contributing something. Because if the lamps are installed and people come and vandalize it and nobody raises an eyebrow, then they are not contributing anything. So they 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 have the ownership. They own they own the, the street light, the project. So that, that is my own, that uh, everybody should contribute something, no matter even if it's a penny. Uh, whenever you are called upon, try and do something you don't have to be rich in quotes for, for you to be able to contribute your own quota to such a laudable 
communal effort. Okay. In your uh, simple words, what would you like to tell the youth of Fubuta about this project? Uh, the youth of Fubuta, um, Fubuta belongs to you. Every generation, like all those people that have called, my father and who they've all left, is our turn now. And soon we will leave. It will be another people's turn who uh, normally are the youths of uh, uh, today and tomorrow. So uh, own the project, follow the footsteps of the ancestors, contribute your own quota. Don't say it's, uh, you are not involved. You are involved because you will inherit all these things. So the youth should come out and own this project and do everything to advance it. So they will copy what we are doing now by also bringing up initiatives. I will hope that the Buddha people will uh, start paying for their electricity. Once the, the, the houses are metered, they should start to stop um, start paying for electricity and stop depending on a deck or whatsoever body to pay their electric bills because the lack of electricity in Ubuta has uh, um, sent us backwards. It has not made us a, a progressive society. Imagine when I was growing up in the 80s, Ubuta had electricity. So, but now, in 2000 plus, Ubuta has steady power supply, if any at all. So, we hope that um, the next initiative, which is to build an independent power plant, uh, will be supported by the first step of Ubuta people deciding to meter up and pay for electricity because any project must be self sustaining. The solar street lamps are self sustaining in the sense that as long as the sun shines, it will replenish the power. But to do an independent power plant or to have uh, 247 electricity supply, you need to pay for it so that people can maintain and resupply the light. Other communities should follow the uh, uh, urban architecture of Uguta, should follow the self-help initiative of Uguta community and develop their own societies to be like that and even take it further. Then the whole of Igbo land will be the, not only a small London, it will become the big London. So that is, we are human beings, and I do believe that we have the intellect, uh, we have the innovative uh, capa capability to advance our societies to be a first world. There's nothing that separates us from these advanced economies or societies. It's just 
the uh, can do spirit. And I do believe that Igbo people have that uh, in their cultural ethos. So I do believe that if we continue very soon, there will be nothing that will separate us from those advanced societies. Because I'm asking that you can't can even follow a gaga because it's very good. Because we are going to do this. Can you? Oh, men are too young enough. Oh, we are going to go on a tour now. Oh, we are going on a tour now. But if you buy, I see not the easy because someone there knows alone. They hear Kafunu Guta. They may be going to meet a guy new. Oh, someone here can be going to meet a friend. Can they walk on it? What one day? Can come? Because they may not be going to meet a guy. Man, I'm going to find a friend. I'm going to find a guy. Because the car, the car, the car. I'm on a. I just come on a day. I walk on the sand. I'm going to go in your yard. Obusi ya niike na kana imegodri. O mai bana parata. O kunetu nothing like that can extend any longer. Bible kura that one there is light that never runs away. Simply the light comes in. Only this year look at light everywhere. Only they need liko. Only they every lick and cone inside of Obuta. I deny a light and light everywhere. So biko. Ndi ne mi ne biko masi biko tuwe gozi ono. Everywhere, bo papa ne o di di Obuta kabo. He is the traditional ruler of Ubutan, and he is our Didi, as I said before. So we thank him for all the support he has continued to give us in the different projects and the different things in the new Buddha. He has consistently provided that support that we need, and we're very grateful to him. And he, he runs an open door policy. I'm not saying that people don't know this, but that is the truth. If I give or if you get a he will call you back. He wants to hear about what's happening in Ubuta. He wants to hear your concerns. He wants to discuss detailed than Ubuta. So um, I thank him. I thank the soul administrator uh, who has given us the support. The PG who have given us support and all the stakeholders in Ubuta, Ubuta, they are living in Ubuta. Maybe they are more than the other people. So, um, because we are being atinyanya, we cannot be sadly or calmly. Let us continue to develop Ubuta. That is what we really want. And I want to use this opportunity to thank a group called Good Friends. Association in Ubuta, they are doing much lovely now. Because we're doing the Woji. And let all the different groups come up. Can you go to Ubuta? Because you need to be a young man. You need to be a We want to get enough from here to do one final. Ubuta, Obi Ham, the Emka, the Emobutrunye. Makana Mron non aro, etch non etch, Ngubutaya de or de Buana. Every part of Ubuta, an orco Mbona, in the Nine, contributor, Gondenine to Rego, a Kenena Mono. In the Nine, ye use a walk on a bicone, Negidani Anya, Negidani Anya. Kani ne e chepube na chupuna ye ini ani aka. Kani me kuguta ne up to 24 hours a day. Kani put the first community na Nigeria ye me kungono. Ni ma ni me mom nongem. Eku em na ni ye me pua ni ngeri ke. Ani ngeri chepube. Ani ye ma. Na yo chupuko de ma ni ndo kani fua na ya. Mbona. Uguta makau, ameje makai, ameje mamara mabodo. Uguta makau, ameje makai, ameje mamara mabodo.